Perhaps a rich idiot like you can waste the day. But I have children to feed. Decide. Hey, did you change your mind? When I discover that you betray me, perhaps. I hear you took the bike for yourself, my employee of the month. Listen, man, me and Lamar was gonna get that back to you, dawg. Oh, I am sure. You will get this car off the daddy's boy, and then we talk. Insurance papers say they have a locked garage, so you'll need to gain access from inside the house. Man, it's never easy with you, is it, Simi? Do not talk to me about easy, you thief. Just because you have a massive gaper, bitch! Fucking homo, you're dead! Dead! He said I had a massive... Jimmy called me a bitch! He tried to knife attack me? No one creeps on the J... Ooh, ouch! Raperino! You're a waste of semen, bitch! I don't care if you're 12. I'll still rape you. Thank you, coach. You're a real pro, Mrs. DeSantha. A real pro. Well, you're a great student. Now just loosen up those hips. Okay, like this? Yeah, loosen them up. There you go. And follow through. Perfect. Oh, okay. I think I'm getting it. Ooh, okay, Amanda. All right, now just follow through. God, you've got great hips. You know that? Follow through. 
Yeah, I could get used to this. <laughs> oh. Excellent. Yes. Now slide your hips slow and sit into it right here. No, right here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I could totally get used to this. Oh. Hey, Simeon, I got the ride, man. I'm coming back. Yeah, if you actually bring the repossession to me this time, I can have it back out on the street before the day is done. That's a 9mm semi-automatic pushed against your skull. Uh, well, look around. You just keep driving where you're going. Hey, come on, man. This was a repo job. Guy's behind on this fucking note. Unlikely, considering my son just got the car. And looking at the way you're going about this, my guess, you're working a credit fraud. A credit fraud? Be serious, dude. I just worked the fucking repo. I appreciate a kid who follows orders without taking responsibility. Yeah, maybe one day we'll have a beer, and I'll explain how the world really works. Who gives you the slip? A car dealer, dawg, by the name of Simeon Terry. So this businessman... He look legit to you? Look, man, it's just between him and your fucking son. Don't worry. Me and Mr. Yatarian, we'll work this out. Jess up here. Okay. Stop the car. Pull up. Look out! That's great. Good for you. That the place? Yeah, this the place, man. Whoa. Drive into it. Right through the fucking window. And fast. Or I'll put two rounds in the back of your skull and do it myself. Man, you can't be for real. I look like a fucking joke to you. Man, fuck my life, man. Fuck. Come on, kid. Sammy, it's not exactly how it looks. I always trump big for a job well done. Now get out of here, kid. You motherfucker! I won't be treated like this! I will... Simeon Yatarian doesn't back I down stop. from anybody. Uh. Hey, you recognize this car? Huh? Does it look like it's worth five grand a month to you? You fucking racist! I'll tell you something. This thing's gonna need some serious bodywork, or it's worth five grand a month. He agreed to financing I have his signature. Yeah, did he agree to have some punk break into my fucking house? I, I don't know. I, uh... That kid might be a fucking idiot. 
But you are a fraudulent scumbag piece of shit. Ugh. Don't make me have to come back here. Excuse me, sir. Can I talk to you for a second? The fuck are you talking about? I am talking about a hotline straight to heaven that this state makes illegal. Yeah, this is what I'm talking about. I don't give a fuck about reform. No, no, they rigged the vote. I saw the ballots. It's a lie. It's democracy at work, amigo. Democracy can suck my fatty. Democracy only works when it lets intelligent people do what they want. This? This is tyranny by morons. <laughs> yeah, well, I got things to take care of in a little place called reality. You want to drive? Nah, I'm not a drug guy. This isn't bushweed. This is mana. And I grow it myself. No paranoia, no weirdness. A passport to nirvana. Fuck, give me that. Yeah, here, you'll hardly feel it. Yeah, I smoke all day, and I'm fine. It's a pure, mellow high. But I do get concerned about the monsters. Yeah. I mean... I'm sure they're nothing serious, but, uh... Oh. I never let them get too near. Oh, the fuck! What is that? I really screwed myself this time. Never again! 
After that, you see, the liquor companies push for continued prohibition, which is complete insanity. <laughs> so I take it I can count on your support. The fuck just happened? What are you talking about? We discussed globalization, the state. Stay the fuck away from me. What? But it's a good cause. Drive into me!
What do you want? Man, I come by for that drink you offered, that's all. I wasn't really serious about that. What? Uh, you're here, whatever. Sit. You're not gonna rob me again. Man, I never robbed you. That was just a repossession. <laughs> okay. You call it whatever you want to call it. I really don't care. What can I do for you? Shit, I just came by to see if there's something I can help you with. I see you doing well for yourself. Look, I'm retired. Ain't you a bit young for the pipe, slippers, and staring at a fucking sunset? You know, I've been in this game for a lot of years, and I got out alive. That makes me the right age. <clears throat> you look like a good kid. But if you want my advice, you give the shit up. You work hard, screw over everybody that you love. Hurt, rob, kill indiscriminately, and maybe, just maybe, if you're lucky, you become a three-bit gangster. It's bullshit. Go to college. Then you're gonna rip people off and get paid for it. It's called capitalism. Hmm. So what I saw the other day was like, when a corpse briefly reanimates itself and terrorizes everyone, right? What you saw the other day was a guy dealing with pests. I guess I never saw myself as just a fucking pest. Well, and today's lesson's all about humility. Tomorrow we'll try a training montage. A training what? No. I was just lost in an 80s movie fantasy. <laughs> yeah, I can see you spend a lot of time there. Yeah, as much as I can. So that's why you're here in Vinewood then, right? Maybe I'm here because I'm just an idiot who thinks that imported palm trees are a good substitute for not really knowing what the fuck you're doing on this earth. Jesus, man. You a good time, you know that. I tell you what. <sighs> Least I can do is buy you that beer. There's a little bar I like. <sighs> it's not too far from here. Let's go. All right, man. I'm following you. <sighs> Let's take Amanda's car. Hey, Jim. I'm going for a drink. Dad, with... shit! I mean, our boat going down the Western Highway. It's it's been stolen. What? The yacht's been stolen? I, I was trying to sell it. I know you didn't want it sold, but I need money, and they don't want to buy it. They just want to take it. I'm hiding in the head. You're insane. All right, I'm coming for my boat. All righty then. Change of plans. My darling boy is in trouble. Hey, I'll help you out. Lesson number one. Don't ever have kids. Hey, man, look. If I had kids, 